Hello dear students, welcome to your PDF. Now I am going to discuss one question that was asked previously in HPCL interview for an electrical engineering candidate. That question is, yeah, please read the question. That question is, what are the plants, power plants, what are the power plants that can run as peak load plants? First of all, what kinds of plants we have? The plants we know are, yes, these are the types of plants we have, yes, thermal, thermal, second one, hydel, yes, hydel plants, yes, or hydro plants, hydro plants, means with water, wind, yes, diesel, yes, solar, and uh, gas, very important, gas power plants, nuclear also, nuclear, nuclear, yes, nuclear, so these are the general plants we know. So in these, uh, some plants are used as base load plants uh, and some plants are used as peak load plants. First of all, what does it mean by a base load plant? What does it mean by a peak load plant? Okay, base load and peak load. Let's understand that point. Ma. Let's understand what does it in, mean by base load plant and what does it mean by peak load plant? See, base load plant is a plant which is uh, operated continuously. Okay, let me write that point here. Base load plants are the plants. Base load plants are the plants are the plants which run runs continuously continuously and and per unit cost of electricity is very less in this one and per unit cost of electricity or electrical energy electrical energy is less I can say less yes so these only can be used as base load plants okay means uh, uh, suppose I, 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 I will tell you like this if you come to this uh, hydro plants the cost of the fuel is I can say zero water is used as a fuel I can say input the water is going to hit the turbine due to that turbine rotates and generator rotates so we are getting uh, power so these plants I can say thermal thermal hydro nuclear and uh, these can be uh, these can be used as uh, I can say and uh, wind also sometimes can be used as base load plants but uh, I can't use wind as base load because uh, wind keep changing wind keep changing that's not uh, in fact reliable and see the plant which is used as a base load plant must be a reliable one it means continuous power supply is required from that and with low cost now imagine one situation uh, in in your area there is one political campaign today all of a sudden that political campaign require lots of uh, mics and lighting system which require a lot of electrical energy then all of a sudden there is a demand there is a spike in the demand there is a spike in the demand now what is a peak load plant a peak load plant is a plant which supplies power or which will come into picture when there is a spike in demand and which will be switched off when there is a reduction in the demand and the cost of that peak load plant per unit electricity cost is high compared to this base load plant. Okay, let's understand what's a peak load plant. Peak load plant, peak load plant will, will come into picture, come into operation, come into operation when there is a spike spike in demand when there is a spike in demand and off 
when demand reduces when demand reduces when demand reduces so this way i need a plant this way see i need a peak load plant for that purpose the cost of the cost of the cost of per unit electricity per unit electrical energy of a peak load plant peak load plant is is more compared to is more compared to base load plant base load plant see whenever there is an emergency then only we will be using this uh, peak load plants otherwise we always use base load plants and uh, one more thing what is the basic requirement of this peak load plant it must have uh, the capacity to switch on and switch off uh, within less time yes we need the speed of operation of this peak load peak load plant to be high such a type of plants only we are going to choose as peak load plants the time of operation the time of the time or i can write like this the peak load plant the peak load plant must have must have a very less a very less switch on and off time switch on and off time yes see all of a sudden we got a demand for the power supply then suddenly our peak load plant has to supply suppose if you take thermal plant it takes a, some minimum of four to eight hours to come into uh, operation so that much time is not there for us why because all of a sudden we got the demand then which type of plants are suitable for this particular operation which type of plants i can say these plants are suitable see uh, the following plants can be the following plants plants can be used as can be used as yes peak load plants peak load plants what are those the first one is gas yes uh, gas gas plants natural gas plants yes diesel plants and wind and solar solar also so these can be used as a uh, peak load plants here in the list of the plants i forgot to write the solar yes i wrote solar also yes so i think all of you understood the what does it mean by a peak load plant and base load plant which plants can be used as peak load plants a very good question ma see uh, there is a reason behind uh, every uh, i can say concept why only uh, gas or uh, uh, wind or solar are used or diesel are used as peak load plants they can switch on and off uh, within very less time thank you